In the last video we learned about the German diphthong I and as promised we are going to have a look at the other two German diphthongs in this video. Let's start with the AU diphthong. There is an equivalent in English and you can find it in words such as brown. It starts with an A sound as in father and then glides into an U sound as in look. But the transition is very fast. Au. Au. The Au diphthong in German is always spelled AU. Au. And as with the I diphthong, the stress is always on the first vowel. For example, Frau is never pronounced Frau. Okay, let's have a look at some words with this sound. Listen and repeat. Auge, Auge, Haus, Haus, Kaufen, Kaufen, Genau, Genau, Blau. Blau. All right, let's move on to the third and last diphthong, oi. The corresponding English sound can be found in the word boy. It starts with an o sound, as in not, and then glides into an e sound, as in lip. And again, the transition is very fast, oi, oi. The oi diphthong can be spelled eu or eu. Both combinations are pronounced in the same way. Oi. Here are some words that contain this diphthong. Please feel free to repeat after me. Deutsch. Deutsch. Leute. Leute. Läuft, läuft, häufig, häufig, Euro, Euro. Many learners pronounce this last word as Euro, but that's wrong. In German we pronounce the European currency as Euro. It starts with the same sound as the English word oyster. Euro. All right, let's compare the two diphthongs to highlight the differences and also to make sure that we get the pronunciation right. Repeat after me. Laos. Läuse. Maus. Mäuse. Haus, Häuser, Baum, Bäume, Augen, Eugen. That's it. Now you know how to spell and pronounce the German diphthongs Au and Eu.